everyone, and welcome to another Excel chat video walkthrough with your host, Kevin Kelly. And today, we're going to be talking about conditional formatting using if statements. So without further ado, let's get right into it. As you can see, I have my Excel file open with the Excel chat article as well. What we are going to try to do is highlight the rows where the due date is equal to the month of April. So we have a bunch of invoice numbers, due dates, and amounts, and we basically want to say, okay, all of the rows here that have a due date of April, we're going to highlight that and make sure that it's all green so we can identify it quickly. This would be great if we had you know, a ton of data points or even a small amount of data points. So we're going to do that really quick here. So we're going to go to conditional formatting, we're going to go to new rule, we're going to go to use a formula to determine which cells to format. And as you can see, I have the formula right here in the Excel chat article. And basically what this formula does it says, okay, equal to the month in the column of B12. You see that little dollar sign there because we're anchoring it to B12 or to B2. That allows us to highlight the entire row instead of just the cell. And we're saying that's going to be equal to four. Four being the fourth month of the year, which is April. So all the dates that have April here are going to be highlighted the whole row. And we're going to make sure it's highlighted in green. Okay. So... We're going to hit OK. Oops, I forgot to highlight here. Make sure you highlight the area first. Quick mistake. We'll fix that real quick. Cool. OK, so as you can see, all of the rows that have the month of April as the due date are highlighted. Um, we're able to do that because we anchored it using dollar sign B2. And very simple, very quick, very to the point. That's how we do it. Conditional formatting using if statements, valuable tool. Uh, make sure if you need more help, you visit Excel Chat. The website is got it.ai. Please visit it if you need any more help, and we'll see you next time. Still have questions? Click to get help from a live Excel expert at Excel Chat.